The piece you just heard is called Flocks a Mile Wide, and it's the overture to The Lost Birds. It was inspired by the story of the passenger pigeon, a bird that used to number in the billions, that soared across the North American plains in flocks that stretched for hundreds of miles. It was once unthinkable that the most populous bird species in the world could ever be hunted to extinction. But that's exactly what we did. I'm haunted by stories like this, as well as the loss of other birds, because their extinction portends the loss of many other species, and possibly our own extinction as well. And while we may not be able to bring these birds back from the dead, we can at least honor their memory. That's why I'm composing a new work that's a memorial to them, a requiem for all those species that we've driven to extinction. Using the words of poets such as Emily Dickinson, Christina Rossetti, and Sarah Teasdale, it will be an elegy that celebrates their beauty, but also mourns their loss. Joining me on this album will be the celebrated British vocal ensemble, Vultures 8. Backers will have the chance to attend their recording sessions, both online and in person, as they help tell the story of these lost birds. And after we're done recording their parts, We'll be journeying to the legendary Abbey Road Studios, where I'll be joined by my longtime collaborators, the Royal Philharmonic Orchestra. Follow along as one of the greatest symphony orchestras in the world makes the definitive recording of my new work in the most famous recording studio in the world. I'll be documenting these sessions, as well as every aspect of the composition, recording, and release of this new album in this Kickstarter. It'll be a real-time glimpse into the creation of a new work, one that will hopefully memorialize the beauty of these lost birds for all eternity. So come join me and watch the creative journey unfold. Let's honor these creatures through the art form that does memorials best, music. I'm Christopher Tin. I'm making an album called The Lost Birds, and I invite you to join in its creation.